Time to play with some clay. Well, as you can see, I got my horse's skull. A friend of mine sent that to me years ago, probably 20, 30 years ago, from uh, Oregon. And it was a wild horse that uh, had died out on the prairie, and they sent me the skull, and I had to clean out all the, uh, <laughs> the, the little bugs that, uh, you know, that were inside the, the skull, but it, it, it's good. I painted it the color of clay just so that uh, I get a good shadowing from the light, and I can see the shape a little bit better. Anyway, I'm going to use that to help me uh, do the horse's head. Um, I'm, I've been having a hard time working for the last couple of days. Just My brain just ain't been here. And it still really isn't. And, but the only way I'm going to get going is just get going. So I'm going to get started and I'll be right back. All right, I'm just plotting out the uh, skull. I'm not going to go any further as far as videoing this because uh, I pretty well cover all this in, in uh, three DVDs that I have, instructional DVDs on sculpting a horse. I've got one on sculpting uh, a horse's head. I've got one on sculpting a horse and rider, and I've got one on just creating a horse from scratch. Uh, you might check those... Uh, DVDs out at the link listed below this video. I'm just quickly sketching in the skeletal structure of the uh, horse's skull. I'll come back and work on the horse's skull once I get further along with the uh, anatomy of the horse. I'm just that will probably be close to the last thing I do.
I know it looks rough. And that's because I'm just basically sketching in. I'm not really taking my time to work out every muscle. And also a Mustang's a different than a quarter horse or a Morgan. They're leaner. But they are built to go where quarter horses and Morgans can't go. They are quite literally like a billy goat. There's a movie, I think, on YouTube called Tumbleweed. I think that's what it's called. It was Audie Murphy. And in that movie, he actually rides a... Uh, ends up riding on a uh, Mustang, a uh, Cayuse. And uh, that horse could go where the uh, sheriff couldn't go, who was chasing Audie Murphy in the movie. I mean, he literally could climb up a mountain that uh, the quarter horses just didn't have the uh, agility and the ability to uh, go up. The uh, Cayuse and the uh, Barbs were all horses of the Old West. Uh, quarter horses didn't actually get used by a lot of the Native Americans until after about the 1940s. Uh, I'm sure they had them before, but you'll see a lot of photographs of, uh, of uh, Native Americans on a horseback uh, in the 40s and the 30s sitting on a uh, Mustang. And, uh, all right, I'm going to call it quits for tonight and uh, come back to this tomorrow. Uh, if you, uh, like my video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe and click the little bell down there in the, uh, to the, uh, right of the, uh, subscribe button. That way you'll get, uh, updates of my, uh, videos when I post them. All right, good night, everybody, and I'll, uh, see you next time. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right, see you next time.